Fish Tank Diaries. Today is Sunday, September 18th, 2016. <clears throat> it's 2.11 p.m. Taking a moment here to admire <clears throat> this Marine Line 56 gallon aquarium that I set up. Uh, I, I haven't done an update on on how many days, but I would I would have to guess we're getting close to the 100 and 10 day mark or maybe even 120 and the reason I'm shooting this video is because take a look at that clown loach over there he's fine but he likes to rest on his side look at that just like that clown loaches tend to play dead and sometimes they do weird things they could be uh, they're always interesting really I particularly like clown loaches you see he's fine he just turned himself over The aquarium looks fantastic. Unfortunately, we lost one of the other loaches. And I am at this moment wondering where is the other one? Because I have two. Where is the other one? Let me take a look at them. There they are. I love how they have kind of like mice faces. They look like mouses. And they like to hang around together. There's Tabasco, the fish that started the whole thing right there he's always hanging around at the top over here or he comes and rests in the uh, magnet I have a problem with the um, neon tetras they keep on disappearing I have added in here about 40 I wanted to create a, a nice school of them but I don't know who's to blame here, but I'm thinking the the bala sharks. I think these guys are responsible for eating those uh, small neon tetras. So I am not pursuing that dream anymore. It's a very nice and peaceful tank. I have people commenting on my videos, you cannot keep that discus in there, and you cannot do the goldfish, and this and that. You know what? This thing has been going on for months. I just make sure that my parameters are good, that the water is clean, that they are fed properly. They can coexist together with no problems. I keep my water temperature at around 77 degrees and everything is hunky-dory. <clears throat> 